Hi folks, it's Ron from Barlow here. I'm alive, I'm alert, and I feel great. Apparently, you did a search for what is the difference between a sofa and a couch. I uh, got this information pulled together for you, courtesy of CollinsDictionary.com. What is that thing you see there, that piece of furniture? Now here's the interesting stuff. The word origin of sofa is sofa, sofa, from the Arabic. And they call it a dais upholstered as a seat. I don't know. A lot of words that words they're going to throw in here, but the word upholstery is significant to me when we're talking about sofas. Here's the American uh, definition. An upholstered couch, usually of spring construction, with fixed back and arms. I think the, the, the significant thing is that it's upholstered and it's got springs, but... Uh, you be the judge. I'm just giving you the definitions. Now, in Britain, we're sort of allied with Britain in our language. Uh, we would call it, as a Canadian, an, upho an upholstery seat with a back arms for two or more people. Nothing they don't mention the spring construction, but what the heck. And I would think it was more, uh, more of an, uh, a luxury item than what a coach would be. The, this here, look, that seats many people. <laughs> it's a great thing to have around. Now, when we go to the word couch, in American, it's an article of furniture, of furniture on which one may sit or lie down. When you throw that word sova and div divan or div divan in again, just to throw us off. Now, in Britain or the Canadianized kind of point of view, it's a piece of upholstered furniture, a couch usually having a back and arm rest for seating more than one person. And to me, this is more of the idea of what I would <clears throat> call a couch. <clears throat> nothing elaborate, not, nothing luxurious. But uh, Okay, thanks for sticking around. I hope you uh, go underneath the description of the video to um, video, YouTube video uh, description and click on the big red submit button, button and submit to my channel or just leave a like or a comment. Also down there you'll find a link to a way to make a passive income online that I'm pretty excited about. Do what you wish with it and I'll say hope to see you again. Bye for now.